Now, seven-year-old Katlejo Olifant is being laid to rest this morning in Naledi, Soweto. The boy was in ICU for a week from suspected poisoning after eating a snack allegedly bought from a local spaza shop. Now, five of his friends were buried last week. The incident sparked tensions in Naledi, with residents calling for stricter health and safety regulations at local spaza shops. Our reporter Lindiwe Mpanza joins us for more. Lindiwe, uh, good morning to you. Yet another sad morning for this community. A very good morning to you, Jenna Lee. Like you said, yet another sad morning for the community of Naledi. Today we are burying seven-year-old Katleho Olifant, who passed away last week Sunday uh, while we were burying five of his friends. We will know that uh, the little boy was in ICU for seven days. Now Katleho was with the other five children um, who passed away when they allegedly consumed snacks that were bought at a local uh, spa shop alleged contaminated snacks uh, that we know today may have claimed the, the lives of those five uh, six children now uh, but also it is really Katlejo's passing is really a sad one generally if I can tell you because I mean he gave that glimpse of hope to the family of the five children but also the community of Naledi that he would make a miraculous recovery and you know live to tell the tale you know just give us to shed some light on what actually happened on that fateful day when those children consumed those alleged snacks. You know, um, the community of Naledi are really in mourning. It is a dark time for this community. You will also remember that in October last year, two other children died under the same circumstances. You know, with community members saying Naledi can no longer, cannot become a graveyard for children. 